Hi everyone, uh, my name is Mia Delve. I'm the Creative Programme Officer at A-Space Arts uh, and I'm joined today by special guest, the Mayor of Southampton, Councillor Sue Blatchford. And we're here today to draw out names from a hat to find which 10 lucky local artists will be awarded a Lucky Dip bursary. The winning artists will receive £500 to fund the creation of a new artwork or art activity which will be exhibited in a group show at the end of the year hopefully post-COVID and in real life at our flagship venue, God's House Tower. This is a new and experimental bursary scheme for A-Space Arts. We've listened to artists in the city and heard about the barriers that they've previously faced accessing funding opportunities. This blind selection is an attempt to remove those barriers and give everybody a fair chance at winning a £500 bursary. At A-Space Arts, we are also proactively working towards becoming an anti-racist organisation and as part of this work, five of the Lucky Dip bursaries will be offered to black and non-black artists of colour living or working in Southampton. These names will be selected first, awarding five bursaries to ethnically diverse artists, followed by the draw for the remaining five bursaries. OK, so without further ado, I'm going to hand over to Mayor Sue Blatchford and we'll find out who the lucky artists are. Over to you. Thank you. <laughs> Thanks very much. And my background is the mayor's office in the Civic Centre, which is a very empty place. Uh, I have got a very special hat. Let me, there we go, with all the gold braid. That is the tricorn uh, that I actually wear as the mayor as part of the regalia of the chain and the red robes and the jabot around one's neck. Okay. You don't want the history lesson. You really want to know which names I'm going to pull out of my, the hat. So, cold fingers. <laughs> the first name is quite a long one, and apologies if I don't get this right. It's Issa or Issa Loyan Farrakelly. <laughs> Not like doing the, the um, FA Cup draw, where they draw out the things. <laughs> and our next. Artist is Kwame Bakaje Hu. Probably didn't get the middle family name right, but it's Kwame. Excellent. And our next name is Mariam Zara Kazimi. Excellent. And, and this will be our last name, won't it? Our last one is. Vincent Warrican. So I will now I remove those from there. And you now I now need to tip in the other names. Okay. Move these around. So our first name out is. Uh, Svetlana, O C H K O V S K A Y A, Oshkovaya. I did get thrown out of my language classes at school. <laughs> I'm ashamed to say. And our next name is going to pick up two. I don't want to separate them out. Next name is Claudia Friend. And our next one is Alex Sutherland. And our next one is Amy Jo Lyons. to be picking up loads because there are loads of you who've applied oh. and our next one is Joanna Rose Tidy that's the last one I think is it one two three four five yes it is it is the last one oh 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 is that oh I'm so disappointed I was quite it yeah. was <laughs> quite exciting getting in the swing of things 
get into the swing of things. Yes, definitely. Well, it's, it's something to actually look forward to the exhibition at the end of the, the year. And it is actually, fingers crossed, let's hope that next winter we actually don't have another um, coronavirus sort of... Outbreak. <laughs> yeah, outbreak that everybody, if they're offered the vaccination to actually have it, it doesn't contain any animal products. It's been well tested and... Um, it is that aspect of hopefully all returning to to normal. Um, yeah, so something to look forward to, especially at God's House Tower, which is such a a fantastic um, exhibition space and such a fantastic space. Now it's actually been changed from that very traditional um, archaeological museum, which I remember as a child. As well. <laughs> Thank you yeah. so much, Sue, and and congratulations. Uh, to everyone who was successful in today's draw. Um, I'll be in touch with the successful artists uh, this week uh, to set up our first meeting. Um, and I just wanted to say that if your name was not selected this time, then please don't despair because there are so many other ways that um, A-Space can help you in your practice. Uh, you can head to the artist development page on our main website to find out more. Uh, and you can also check out the Opportunities Bank on the GHT website uh, to read about our current opportunities and open calls at God's House Tower. Um, links to both of those sites will be posted below this video um, when it's up on YouTube. The Lucky Dip Bursary Scheme is the first in a number of opportunities created by A-Space that are aimed at supporting artists with protected characteristics in our mission to create a more equitable cultural equality in Southampton. Please get in touch if you'd like to get involved in the conversation or if you have any ideas or feedback for us, we'd love to hear from you. If you haven't already, please sign up to our mailing list and follow us on social media to keep up to date with all of our projects and opportunities. And that's it from me uh, and from our special guest, uh, Mayor, Sue uh, Mayor Councillor Sue Blackford. Uh, congratulations again to the winning artists. Um, and yeah, goodbye for now and stay safe everyone. Yep, stay safe. Hi everyone, me again. Uh, as you may have noticed, there were only nine names selected during the filming of the draw. Totally my fault for miscounting. I've never been the best mathematician, uh, but it does mean that I need to select one more ethnically diverse artist to receive a lucky dip bursary. So, here we go. Gulu Kandru. Congratulations, Gulu, um, and to all of the winners of today's draw. Uh, goodbye again, and stay safe, everybody.